welcome to the video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make these mini school books and they're actually functional. You can see there's some paper inside them. You can actually write in them. They're pretty cool. So I'm going to be showing you step by step how to make these today. Let's get started. First you're going to need a piece of cardboard. So what you're going to do is you're going to cut the piece of cardboard to the size of the book that you'd like. So I'm just going to cut mine like this. And then I'm going to trim mine so that it has straight edges and is a little bit smaller. Once you're done that, with that, you're going to go ahead and fold it in half. Okay, once you're done folding it in half, you're going to Make sure to trim the edges, make sure they're nice and smooth, and there's no other cardboard showing. Alright, once you're done with that, we're going to wrap it now. You can take a nice big piece of paper. Mine is just white, but you can use any color you want. As you see in this one, I used pink. So now we're just going to measure this out. Make sure it fits pretty nicely with some left over on all the edges. Then we're going to take a glue stick and we're going to glue the edges to the piece of cardboard. I apologize, it's a little hard to see on a white table. Once you're done with that, it should look like this. And then you're going to take a smaller piece of paper, size it and cut it to fit the front of your book. Then you're just going to glue it to the front of your book, just like that. Once you're finished, it should look like this. Now we're going to make the paper on the inside. First things first, you're going to take a long, wide strip of paper. Measure your book and trim it to fit. Then you're going to measure your book again, this time in the other direction. Once you're done with measuring it out, you can go ahead and fold it like you would with a fan. Fold it one way, flip it over, fold it the other way, flip it over, fold it the other way. Try to stay on the lines the best you can. Once you're done folding it up, select one side and staple it. Since it's mini, I just staple it one time. If you have smaller staples, you can staple it more than once, but I have pretty decent sized staples, so I only staple it once. Now I'm going to trim the edges to make it look nice and smooth, and make sure you can turn the pages. Once you're done with that, go ahead and take the back page and put some glue on it. Take your back page and make sure on the back cover of your book, glue it down. To make it easier, I turn the pages to the back page and press the back page down. That way it's white on both sides. Once you're done with that, it should look like this. The last step is to write a title on the front. Once you're done, it should look like this. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe 
see you next time.